I can't believe I'm finally taking the ultimate trip. As a kid, I always wanted to go to space and battle aliens with laser swords, like that documentary with the astronauts that I saw about the war in the stars. <laughs> My family thinks I'll get into less trouble up there than I will down here. We'll see about that. Nothing, nothing, nothing! Stop it! You're gonna get keyboard forehead again. What's up? You know that Michaela girl? I found out at school that her last name's McAllister. I did a search on every social media site and couldn't find a single D about who she is or where she's from. No way. Nobody can hide from the internet, especially from you. Except for her. It's like she's some kind of ghost. Yeah. Very fashionable ghost. Trucy's. Dad, what are you doing home? Uh, it's OK, Cam. There was some commotion at the office. I just couldn't concentrate. Something's up at Space Inc.? What's wrong? Uh, well, it's probably nothing. But the office received a strange phone call. Some type of anonymous threat against the Prince's launch. Who'd want to hurt the Prince? He's harmless. And adorbs. <laughs> and entertaining. Which makes him totes adorbs. I know, right? Totes adorbs. But apparently, somebody doesn't agree with you. Attention, Space Inc. Dismantle your plans for the Prince's launch immediately. I'm warning you, there will be devastating consequences for people around the world if Prince Xander's flight is not canceled. That's all I can say. Well, I'm totally creeped out. Well, the office gets crazy messages like this all the time. Everyone just thinks it's a hoax. And you? I'm not so sure. You know, last night, I accidentally left my laptop at the office closed. And this morning, it was open. That's kind of freaky. Yeah, I thought so too. And with this weird phone call message, I'm thinking somebody's trying to get some information about the flight. Hmm. Well, if you want, I could tap into Space Inc. security system and see if anyone's been lurking around there. Uh, it's impossible to break into the cameras. The uh, firewall is... Uh, is I mean... Is... Man, you were good at that. Look, there. Do you know who that is? I can't tell. I mean, it could be a janitor or a security guard. Looks more slender. Maybe the security guard's doing Pilates. Or maybe it's a woman. Hmm. Maybe. I, I better go call security. Thanks, girls. Look at us. We're like expert detectives, right? I bet if we do some investigating of our own, we can find that sketchy hacker ourselves. Bet we could. Now think, who in our tiny little town would want to threaten the prince and his mission? Got me. It's like the coolest thing to happen here since Emma Danielson thought Selena Gomez was following her on Instagram, but then found out it was a different Selena Gomez. Ah, but what if the blurry hacker isn't from here? What if it's someone who recently showed up out of nowhere, makes excuses, and carts around an eight by 10 of the prince? Hmm. What an interesting and weird thought at the same time. You were right. Devin's exactly where you said she'd be. Yep, Devin gets angry about something, Devin expresses it through graffiti, Assistant Principal Wilson freaks, Devin gets in trouble, and Devin has something else to be angry about. It's the circle of life. OK, let's go talk to her. I hate the talking to her part. What's up, Devin? Looks like you got a lot of cleaning to do there, huh? Yep. Well, if it helps, I always find cleaning to be soups relaxing. When I'm stressed, I organize things, I clean things, I email things, I text things. Say things. So many things. Oh, we're not here to talk. We're here to help. With this. A bike? Not just any bike. A bike, when I add this and do this, generates electricity. <laughs> You might want to put these on. <laughs> Which allows us to power our own personal sandblaster. We create clean energy by letting the pedaling do the work. And as a bonus, it's a great workout. I'm mildly impressed. Now what's in it for you guys? You have to help us amp up our opening act for Elite's contest. You know, with all the funky, cool, artsy stuff you do. Look. I appreciate the compliment, but I'm gonna have to pass. Ah, this cleaning doesn't bother me. I could do this all day. Fine, have fun. I don't wanna do this all day. We were hoping you'd say that. Okay, I'm in. 
awesome. <laughs> but on one condition. You promise not to talk as much as you normally do. Deal! You have my word, and my word is rock solid. Just take it from my girl Cam here. She knows that when Bright and Bandwa, she promises. <laughs> no one can resist my delicious gelatin treats. Chip Chip Hurry every Friday. From the size of this crowd? Wait! Everything's going according to plan. Maddie's going to take the green gummy bait for sure. Uh, Ember, we got ourselves a gummy bear hog. No, Randy. It'd be polite to leave some of Adrian's gummies for the other customers. Just saying. Who are you, Evergreen? The gummy bear police? <laughs> That's cute. Now don't make me ask you again. Randy, you should try some of my famous honey beads made with drops of honey, cold olive oil, and agar agar. So nice they named it twice. Here. Wow, talk about a great disguise. Yeah, but not great enough to fool her little sister. Welcome to Cafe Adams. The midship was a wise choice. <laughs> and feel free to load up on toppings. Hey, you told me I couldn't. Chatting with the customer, Randy. Where was I? I myself am a chocolate sprinkles, crushed peanuts kind of gal. What kind of person are you? A person who's leaving. You have a visitor, sir. A visitor? Who? Could I have a visual, please? Snow regrets. What is he doing here? He must work for Stone. Cam, you read me? Go for Cam. No regrets is in the elevator on his way up from the basement. Implement stalling tactics. Roger that. Hold the door, young man. I don't move as fast as I used to. Oh, dear me. Thanks, Sonny. Oopsie daisy. We don't have much time. Miles, I really need a record of that transfer pronto. Oh, someone's going to the penthouse. Fancy. Miles, hurry. Hmm, now what floor was it? Ah, the fifth. Wait, no. Was it the seventh? Yeah. It was the seventh floor. Or was it the ninth? Guess I'll know when I see it. Would you like the records printed or viewed as a PDF? PDF, please, but hurry, Miles. Getting too risky. We'll have to come back. No, I'm not leaving without proof. Dad is innocent. Ha! Huh, here you go, sir. It was buried deep. Okay. Wait! Miles. 
Please erase the database from the time I returned home until I leave today. Keep no record of this visit. What visit, sir? 